All right, so you plan a holiday meal. Maybe you're giving a party. Uh, you don't want to be the party where everybody goes home sick. That's what they remember. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, right. It happens. So, Winter Consumer Reports in Yonkers up in New York. Talk to their food expert. Take a listen. So, over the holidays, a lot of people love to slice up citrus, put it into the sangria, um, put it into different drinks. Um, also, people like to zest a lot, use it in cookies, various other things. Margarita is good any time of year. Margarita is good too. So, here's our advice though if you are going to use it raw, you may want to consider getting organic versions of these things because they won't be treated to the same degree on the outside of the fruit with either fungicides or have the same pesticides that were used. So it's not unsafe to use a conventional brand, but if you use these raw and you're using the peels themselves, it's not a bad idea to go organic. And get this, Robin. So you know how natural means only natural things can be put into it, like on your meat? Well, Urvashi from Consumer Reports just told me that that means they can pump your meat up with salt water, because salt water is natural. Yeah, that's right. And, and I think that's where the traps really are, is that you can buy a product labeled as natural, and it can be pumped up with salt or salt water. In fact, up to 40% salt water, in which case you're paying a whole lot for water and yeah. not for the meat. So make sure you pay close attention to the labels, whether salt or a salt solution was added or not. Don't rely on natural. Certainly don't pay more for it. You know, I never would have paid more for organic citrus until I heard her say that. Because, of course, sometimes I'm putting the lemon into the drink. All right. And, okay, and so her point was the it's, pesticides go right in there then. And fungicides, yeah, they're right on the